Bariatric surgery has helped countless Americans lose weight, but Dr. John Burns with the Dallas Plastic Surgery Institute says massive weight loss can have an undesirable effect on the body. The weight loss leaves the patient with extra skin. What's happened is the body has expanded to accommodate the weight, and then with the weight loss, the skin has been expanded beyond its ability to recoil or bounce back. Depending on the amount of weight loss, some patients require a tuck while others require a lift. A lot of times if the uh, excess skin and fat is confined to the front, we can limit it to a abdominoplasty or an extended abdominoplasty or tummy tuck where the incision stops at the hip bone on either side and then we can do liposuction of the side areas. But if those side areas are also hanging over the belt line, then we need to do what we call a circumferential abdominoplasty or a circumferential tummy tuck where we actually do the back and then position the patient on the front and do the front as well. The breasts and arms are often contoured during one surgical procedure. But if a patient would hold their arm to the side, you'd have a, it has been called a bat wing or an area of excess skin that hangs down. It runs from the armpit to the elbow. And so the procedure would be to remove that, trying to conceal the scar at the middle part of the arm from the elbow to the armpit. And that's called a brachioplasty or arm lift. And then with the breast, uh, sometimes the breast needs to be reduced, but more often than not, it's just removing the excess skin and repositioning the nipple on the breast, and that's called a mastopexy. Sagging skin can also affect the face. You get deepening of the lines around the mouth significantly, jowling where the cheeks fold over the jawbone, and the neck is a common area where the loose skin hangs and it creates an illusion that the, that the uh, neck comes all the way up to the chin. From head to toe, body contouring can help weight loss patients complete their journey. But it is a journey. It's a lot of time, a lot of effort to get to the point where you can have the plastic surgery that you need to get back to the weight and the way that, that you looked and the way that your body looked before you gained the weight. And that's what we'd love to do.